First, you're gonna open up Chrome, Google Chrome, type in Google Earth Studio, type in try, type in new blank project, type in New York. That'll make us 10 seconds. Start, and you'll have two windows open. Type in New York in your search. Now you have New York, use your option mouse or option trackpad to move orientation around and find your start point. Once you find your start point, you're going to find your uh, track point as well that you can add. So you navigate to that, right click, set track point, type in New York. And now you're going to add your keyframe for your start point. You're going to drag down the line and then zoom out with your trackpad or scroll wheel. Add another keyframe for your out point. And then you're going to command or control click or alt click the keyframes to ease in and ease out. Now your animation will be going from close to far. If you want to swap that, you simply grab the keyframes and swap the keyframes around. Once that's done, you click render. And you select image sequence select your location where you want your image sequence to go and click start make sure you have a JSX on the output once that's done you open up After Effects go file scripts run script file navigate to your JSX file in your New York folder click the JSX file that will bring everything in and it will give you uh, animation with text and modify the text color and use your uh, 3d scroll wheels to modify the location and your font size and such and you can use anchor point to center it and once you've set all your positioning, you can duplicate the text layer and use a 3D scroll wheel to make a shadow behind, extend the length a little bit and add a Gaussian blur or a blur to it to make a shadow. Then you open up your export queue, your render queue, and drag your file in and export. And then you have your first Google Earth Studio movie with text.